everybody welcome back to coach g world glad you're here got a quick tutorial for you today on a duotone double exposure effect in photoshop what you see on screen here is that effect and i'm going to show you how we get it just from one image and a couple of layers okay so let me delete these and here we go we're starting with this locked layer i'm going to unlock it though by clicking this little lock and um what we need to do is make a copy of this image of the gorilla. So I'm clicking the layer, dragging down to this little plus box, and that has a copy. Uh, we'll just call this one layer one. And I am renaming it by simply double clicking on that layer and you can see it get highlighted and I will name this one layer two. So very simple, easy to do. So the layer one that we're going with first, we're going to the effects blending options pulling that up and you can see in our main blending options the blend mode is set to normal of course nothing's been changed there but if you did want to see the other options that are available there, there you go right there but we're sticking with normal 100% opacity advanced blending is going to be at 100% but the channels are what we're going to be affecting today um, we're going to take off the red channel so R is red G is green and B is blue. So we're gonna take off the red channel and click OK for layer one. You won't see anything yet, but layer two, same thing. We're gonna go to effects, bring up our blending options, and we took away red, so now we wanna take away green and blue on the top layer. So when we click OK, still you will see nothing. But if I start to use my arrow keys and hold shift I can slightly move it over and there you go you kind of get like a 3d effect with like you know those 3d glasses effect or whatever um, but that's not quite what we're going for we want this layer to be huge <laughs> and I have uh, one other thing I want to do to that layer let me just click enter to get that change in place and you can see the gorilla on the um, layer two is much larger now. I wanna transform it and flip it horizontally so that it can add some, uh, just a different perspective on the photo. So I go to edit, transform, flip horizontal, and it'll, there we go. And what I wanna do next, you know, it, it this is your own artwork, so I mean, However you want the um, image to look is what you can uh, adjust or tweak right now. But like, I mean, that something like that looks kind of cool. You can kind of see the eyes in the other gorilla, but uh, the other layer, I mean, it's the same gorilla. Um, and there you go, that's it right there. The duotone double exposure effect. You know, once we, apply these changes it will take a little bit for rendering time my computer is running slow right now but whatever um that is the effect duotone double exposure in photoshop real simple easy to do again click on the layer go to effects bring up the blending options advanced blending adjust your channels we took red away from layer one we took green and blue away from layer two and made some adjustments to the overall image and that's what we were left with so I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. It was a real quick and short one, but I wanted you to get some experience, uh, you know, manipulating some more images. So if you have any questions, leave them in the comments. I appreciate all my subscribers. Thanks for checking out the video. As always, take it easy. Peace.